So, uh, apparently that druid's in the nymph's house, so I gotta go all the way back. How did I miss that one? Alright, let's go. Back into the wood. Alright, I've solved your problem, druids. Took an outsider to do it, but, you know, maybe you can give me some more money and... I mean, you, you obviously don't need money. You live in the forest. Alright, where is that nymph's house? There it is. Alright, so... I don't know how I missed him. Or her, or it, or I may have killed him by accident. But, yeah, we... We, we, we solved it, guys! And we did it! Woo! Woo! Alright, maybe I just missed, like... How did I... Alright, I'm gonna... Go... All the way back. Because apparently that druid... Because I know I saved Broody. And I saved Orlon from the spiders. So... He's gotta be here around here somewhere. He can't be the naked guy. Because he said he was a ranger. Alright, so... Did you capture a druid? Well, y you captured a few. Here is a turn! Blah, 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 I welcome blah. and greet you. That's great. Um, I'm looking for a guy. <laughs> I don't know where he is. <laughs> Maybe you can help me. I may have accidentally killed him. Um, okay. Maybe he's in one of these rooms? No? No? I... I w did I... Did I accidentally kill him? I don't remember... The named guy. I don't think so. Why is that tinkling sound, sound story? Alright, maybe he's in one of the side rooms and I just... I just missed him for some reason. Um... Alright, so... There's some... place. I don't see him. Oh dear. Did I, did I really kill him? I don't remember him at all. Like, I don't see him at all. Yeah, I'm an inspiration. By the way, did you capture a druid that was, like, named Terry and I accidentally killed him by accident? Because I should have still completed it, even if I killed him. As cruel as that sounds. Alright, maybe he was in this room? I'm just trying to see. No, nothing in there. Like, there wasn't anybody in here, right? No, that's just a door. Um, I guess I, I guess I can't find him. Alright, maybe he's straight down this way, or that way, or... Yeah, I, I went in here. There's nobody in here. Got some gold. Alright, maybe down this way? Oh! I didn't open that one! Oh, okay! That one makes sense. I missed a door. Okay, okay. Yeah, unlock that, please. Please be in here. <laughs> there you are! Another dominate slave. Hello! I see the nymph bewitched another one. Wait, you don't have the look of beguiled by sorcery. Um, I'm not. I have control of my own mind. Who are you? My name's Ateri. I'm a druid of Neverwinter Wood Grove. And who are you, good man? Oh, somebody who's, um, 
He was polite for once. My name's Moose. Awill sent me to find ya. And I owe both Awill and you a depth of honor. I only wish I'd gotten further in my tradition and saved the spirit of the wood. Ah, uh, how did you end up up here? It's a rather embarrassing story, actually. I thought nymphs were a good source of information, since they have stronger minds than your average woodland animal. I came to the house first, since I had, uh, known this particular nymph in the past. Right, you screwed her in the past, I see. Seems she very pleased to see me, eager even. I was hoping to get some information with her without, well, going into her house. You were suspicious already, weren't you? She did seem a bit more eager than normal to get me into her house. Somewhere in the back of my mind, the part of me was wondering why she never actually used my name, even though we've known each other for quite some time. It seemed odd. Unfortunately, I wasn't thinking clearly. I guess I was just certain that I could handle anything she tried. When she, we got into her house, she suggested I get undressed. Uh-huh. And while I was doing that, she cast a spell on me. I guess she knew how to manipulate you. Next thing I knew, I was locked up in here, unable to escape. The nymph hasn't harmed me, and she won't let me go. Before she enters the room, she casts some kind of spell, and I wake up with no memory of what happened. Now that you free me, I must return to the grove with the other druids. Oh, I cured the spirit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright. You... You were a dumbass. And you were... You thought you were gonna get some. Ow. And you guys are safe now. Great, great. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna loot everything in this house. I'm glad I didn't have to kill you guys. <laughs> I, I, I had to. A lock of nymph hair. One of the many unusual items in the game. This is one of them. Well, the game's self-aware. Congratulations. Bolt of lightning, antidote, stock spell that I can't use because I ain't a druid. Or no, I ain't a wizard or bard. Well, okay, so asshole. Or not asshole. He was at least polite to me. Idiot! Wanted to get some and ended up being captured. What an idiot. Alright, barrel. Potion of lore. Alright, let's get out of here, uh, get our rewards from the druids, and yeah, then we should be all set with this chapter. Woo! Chapter, chapter's done, chapter's done, chapter's done. No, no, chapter's not done, I'm still going to go to Luskin. Crap. Oh, well. Alright, so, to the druid camp. So, let's read this journal while we're going there. Not- I wanna open it. Hold on. Open... Uh, written by Relma before he went insane. Word came from Malgrim in the Tower of Luskin today. I'm being sent to Never Wood- Never- 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 Never went to Wood with some lackeys to attack some spirit creature. The bloody blizz- Wizard gave me a vial of poison, supposed to be incurable, short of a single shot of antidote he gave me. I'm not sure why he gave me the antidote, though. Possibly I could use it for bartering or something. Though Talos knows what we're searching for. Some of his wizards are coming with us. They better not get in my way or I'll... Stupid wizards want to kill me. They said it's the only way to enter the other realm. I'll be damned if I let some bony arse... Idiot wizards let up there be three other cult agents in the area. One hold up in Luskin. Let me just add the finest whorehouses be in that town. The second be exploring some caves to the north of Port Lass, while being the other in Char, a place I know little about. I'm thinking that me adventures be done here. There may be a wee bit of go to earn with such information. And a darn fine pickle me be in now. Hook and hype it both are dead, killed by the spirit while I poisoned the tree. Then those wizards took off and left me here to die. I don't know how, but you can count on Romer to find his way back home. What's wrong with this place? Every landmark disappears without a trace. It seems like there'd be no way out. It makes me want to shout. What in blazes am I rhyming for? I don't know what's happening, but I decided to get better hide the antidote to the poison before I get jumped by the spirit. 
All blasted tonight, the thing wails. Last night I was about to get up and took the motor over the tree. I can't believe what I was thinking. Blah, 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 pile of rocks, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Well, that sucks. Can I talk to this tree? Yeah, it's a it's a tree. Sentient with energy. Blue 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 blue. Yep, found the druids. One wanted to get into the pants of a nymph. Not my problem. Don't know why. I mean, you had a perfectly pretty girl you could have wooed. Probably she's not into him. All right, where is Owl? There we go. Solved all your problems. You guys are useless. I see you are back. Have you had any luck? Found one of you druids. Steadfast Orlon has returned. It's good to have him back in the circle. Here's your gold. Your old druid to have your Bree back. Here's your gold. My dear friend Tatari was welcomed by the grove. Here's your gold. Nature herself is impressed by your duties. Thank you for rescuing all the druids. I have great hope for the spirit of the wood. Good luck. I, I see you are back. Have you had any luck? I cured the spirit of the wood. You've done very well. With the spirit of the wood cured, we can return to our union with nature and her creatures without fear of destruction. Here's 500 gold. Um, can I get more? Alright. Fine. Alright. Going back home! Going back home. How much money do I have now? Okay, so... Back home. Wrong bag. Back home! Guess I'm going to Luskin. Alright, so... I need to sell some shit. This, and... I'll keep the bolts. And... Uh... Could I use some... How many... How many potions do I have left for cure? What should I call it? Two. Four. I should be fine with four. Hey, I'll tell ye. Heal me. Alright, so I should Yeah, I need to bring these this journal back. They're in Luskin, guys. They're in Luskin. Last place I decided to take a look. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course it's a horse. There are no horses. Go. Found two pieces of evidence. I am pleased to see that you have you yet discovered any new information on the cult? You look tired. Have you not been sleeping well? Why do you ask me that? The spy master put you up to this, didn't he? No, he didn't. I see. I suppose my state is obvious enough. Aaron is far more concerned than is warranted, however. Certainly a few bad dreams are not a reason to become alarmed. The servants claim I speak in my sleep and say frightening things. They creep about me cautiously, like I have gone mad. And Eren pays their superstitious twitterings far more heed than he should. After all that has happened with the plague and... and Fenthic, I think a disturbing dream or two is not so surprising, wouldn't you agree? What sort of things do the servants claim you say? Now you too? Has the world gone mad or is it me? These dreams are... Disturbing and frightening, but they shall pass. They are my burden to bear and no one else's. Tell me. Perhaps you are right. Having the perspective of another on these dreams may not be a bad idea. I... I am falling in the dream. Always falling. Surrounded by a heavy blackness which chokes and drowns me. Grasping hands reach out to me. And the voices. A cacophony of whispers that plead to me for help. And... and then I see a shrouded figure. It is Fenthic. He is walking away from me, and I run to catch him. But always he eludes me in the darkness. The voices get so much louder. They are accusing me, blaming me, and I... I feel ashamed, though I do not know what I am being blamed for. I cry out for help, for them to stop their assault, but I go unheeded. And then I catch up to the figure, and I see that it is not Fenthic. He turns and gazes at me with sad eyes, and I know it is Tyr. And then my god turns his back on me. These... these are my dreams. 
Perhaps now you can understand why I have not wished to discuss them. I am frightened of what they may mean. That's fine. I mean, it's understandable. You, you got to talk about these things, you know? I, I could be your ear therapist. Can you pay me to be your therapist? That's understandable. They would frighten me, too. That's kind of you to say. I am glad I told you, at least. It makes the dream seem a bit smaller now. I do feel better for it. Thank you. <laughs> I am reminded a little of how I was introduced to the Paladin life. You should ask me to tell you the tale sometime. Until then, however, let's return to the subject of your task. That is something we can focus on, at least. I'm looking at some information about the cult. This is good news. What have you discovered? Here's a journal. One can only wonder what this cult might have done had their plans in the Neverwinter Wood been successful. Well done. This information suggests that this Mogram and his cult are to be found within Luskin. I do wonder, however, if this is not some attempt on their part to deceive us. Perhaps they meant for you to find this? I would like you to continue your investigation, just in case. I need a second piece of information that supports the first to be absolutely certain it is the truth. We can afford no mistake. Then I wish you luck. I am pleased to see that you remain. Have you yet discovered any new information on the cult? Um, how did you become a paladin? I did say that, didn't I? Are you sure you wish to hear the tale? It is not an exciting one, and I would not wish to bore you. Well, just let me hear about it. As you wish. Do not complain later, however, if you find the tale does not live up to your expectations. I am, after all, no bard. Where should I begin? My family lived in a human village in the wild lands of the northern mountains, and I once longed for nothing more than to be a skilled hunter, as my father was. The village was destroyed when the orcs massed and attacked the Southlands. My family was killed, though I survived. For years, I thought of little but wreaking bloody vengeance upon the orcs. I stalked the crags with my bow, mercilessly killing all I crossed. How did you become a paladin now for that? It was not an easy thing. My lust for vengeance consumed me. I was no better than the beasts I hunted, to be truthful. On the fifth winter of my hunt, I stalked an orc tribe deep into the spine of the world and encountered a blizzard so terrible I could do naught but camp and pray. The blizzard was merciless and lasted days, and as I lay dying in the snow and wind, I spotted a human man approaching. I thought I was mad. He was tall and strong, though I noticed he was missing his right hand. The cold did not seem to affect him, and he looked down at me kindly and picked me up from the snow without effort. I remember nothing beyond that. When I awoke, I found myself at a small ilmetary monastery near the city of Silvery Moon. The monks told me I had nearly died. Who was the man who saved you? I have often thought that he was none other than an avatar of Tyr himself, the Lord of Justice. Though, perhaps that is presumptuous of me. Whoever he was, the Ilmateri monks had not seen him bring me, and I never saw him again. Or perhaps I should say, I never saw him in person. He came to me time and time again in my dreams for many months afterwards, telling me that my vengeance would bring no true justice. I refused him at first, determined to return to my bloody hunt. The dreams came more frequently, and the man grew more stern with me. The path lay elsewhere, I was told, and reluctantly I left the mountains and came to Neverwinter and entered the service of Tyr. The dreams never came again. And then what happened? Tears clerics took me in, and over time I learned their ways and grew to admire the maimed god. I chose to champion justice instead as his paladin, and found peace at long last. My dedication saw me rise through the ranks, and it was much later that I encountered the young acolyte Fenthic, and knew that I had found my true path at last. So were those dreams like the ones you have now? No. No, they are not alike at all. The dreams in the mountains never frightened me as much. They didn't make me feel so helpless and alone. I only compare the current ones to them because they are so strong and disturb me so profoundly. I feel as if something has changed. Something has changed inside of me. What changed? I do not know. Not yet. But I thank you for listening to my tale. 
You have been a great comfort. So, I know your boyfriend's dead, but you want to go out sometime? I am glad to call you Damn a friend. It. And hope friend that you remain with us in the future. For now, however, perhaps our attention should return to your mission. Go friend with Tyr's blessing, then. Friend the gods smile on us that you remain yet unharmed for your efforts. With luck, success may the luck. All right, let's see. Everett's tail, blah, 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 missing druids. All right, so... Um... North Road. To north. Okay. I guess it's time to go. Um, do I have to send... Nope, I got everything I need. I'm gonna head to the Cracked Anvil. Maybe there's some, um... Plus two swords somebody can give me. Uh, Cracked Anvil, Lion's Arms, Aether's House, Docks, Cottage, Cracked Anvil, there we go. And then we're gonna head up to the North Road, get some bandits, kill some more cultists, and then we should be good. There we go, Cracked Anvil. I need weapons. I need good weapons. Give me weapons. Please. Please give me weapons. Can I help you? Purchase. All right, what we got here? Uh, got any? I don't have to sell anything. Protection. I bought that. Plus one. Plus one. Uh, double handers. Okay. Okay. You know what? I'm not gonna need this. Not not the rod. I want the rod of terror. This. We don't need this. I'll be fine. I think. Shit. <laughs> okay. Can Wait. I help you? Uh, what can I purchase here? Got any potions? Not aid. There, and then what's the antidote heal? Restoration. There. Good. Good, we're good. Potion aid, potion restoration, potion restoration. What's this? Potion lore. I will use that. Put you there. This belt's good. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go to the north. 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 North, 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 north. This is north. All right, so we gotta go get some bandits. Delightful. And get the last thing, and help some guy. And three of these books have been found. How many books? Five. So. Fire, death, or charwood. Life rests in towards the cemetery in the walls of Luskin. Towards the south. And uh, treasures. I'll, I'll find them. I'll find them. So I, I returned three? Alright, so I found those two. Um, didn't find that one. Ice is in the tower south of Port Lass. That's uh, so if some treacherous wood deep in Neverwood. I'll backtrack and find them. Unless. I don't know. Tome house in the tower south of Port Lass. I don't rem. <sighs> shit. I don't remember which one I. Where am I going? <laughs> I'm going this way. Um, so I should have found south. I thought I found. So I found three. So I found four. Did I? Did I? They're, they're not in my inventory, right? Where, where are the books? Where, where's the book bag? No. Treaty. Fine. Let's go this way. 
I'll, I'll, I'll backtrack. They'll tell me which ones I found, I guess. Or it's in the mummy thing. I don't know where anything is. 